Good morning, Good morning everybody. guys. So today we are going uh, to a cooking class. Yes. Here in Chiang Mai. Chiang Mai. Um, it's something that Chad wanted to do really bad. Yes. Oh, why would you not want to do that here? I hate cooking. I'm horrible <laughs> well, at it. It's because he, he doesn't know how. Yeah. yeah. And it's time for you to learn. That's yeah. fine. I just like the eating part. <laughs> it's my favorite part. Yeah, it's because Mama makes everything so yummy. She does. Aww, She's the best so, cook. You're so sweet. So we'll just leave it all to her. <laughs> we're just we're just the food tasters. You're funny. But Thai food is super delicious it's and so we have no idea how to cook it. I yeah, mean yeah. I can I basically just throw everything that tastes good together and that's how the meals come out. Um, but it's really nice to be able to know exactly what you're cooking and why you cook it a certain way. Yeah, it's an Airbnb experience. <laughs> so we're gonna go with this lady. She's gonna take us to the local market and yes. see where like she gets all the ingredients from and all that mm -hmm. and then we're gonna go back to a kitchen yeah and she's gonna teach us how to cook it all yes and we chose exactly what to cook and each of us are gonna be cooking different things yeah. um because there were a lot of things on like the the menu to yes. decide what to cook and then, we couldn't decide so we just um, were like let's try one of everything yeah, yeah. there's like um like um the mango rice things like <laughs> the, on the mango sticky rice on the end that we yeah. are going to be making which i'm um, really excited to make because <laughs> i it's just so good yeah it's good but well, we're gonna head down there now because she's probably already waiting for us yes yeah, so we're running late so yep. let's go so yeah, we're going let's go Alright you guys, so we have just finished learning all about the fresh produce and the seasonings that go into Thai food and it is so cool. So she was showing us like there's three different types of gingers, there are three different types of basils that are used. Some are used for like raw food and then some are used in cooking and it's very cool. Definitely a lot of information. And then for seasonings, we learned about something called fried garlic. So they use Thai garlic, which is very small, and they leave the skin on, and then they cook it, like they fry it, and then they use that in different types of foods. And then also they use a oyster sauce instead of salt a lot of the times. She said she they use more salt in desserts and more oyster sauce in savory foods. And then also we smelled some shrimp paste, which they use a lot in food, and then okay. chili paste, which you can use in sandwiches, on toast, they eat it for breakfast, mm. as jam. She said that typically they call it more of a, like a chili jam instead of chili paste because that's how they use it for everything basically. And then we also saw the tamarind, which we actually learned a little about a little bit about when we were making the herbal balls for the elephants that day. Um, they are very good for digestion and they help like regulate you. <laughs> so um, that's some, there, there's two types. I think she said there's a sour and then there's a sweet kind. Mm -hmm. And they use those interchangeably in the Thai food. There's just so much information that we did not know before. And the ingredients are so fresh, mm. like, I love that because mm -hmm. a lot of the time you kind of just use dry spices and herbs and everything was very fresh and very cool. So we're super excited to start cooking now that we have a little bit of a background about it. I'm excited to eat. I got some coffee. I did because it's pretty early in the morning. It's like 8 a.m. And I only have one cup this morning. And I have oh, yeah. a little bit of a coffee problem. <laughs> yeah, she does. She admitted it. You, you heard it here first, guys. It's been admitted. <laughs> I'll admit my problems all day long. All right, so we got our aprons on and we gotta go wash our hands and get ready to start cooking. Okay. <laughs> All right, um, papa Thai. Yeah, look at this. Everyone have soy protein instead of the meat oh, today. Oh, this nice. is the vegetarian Thank version. So ah, we got rice noodles and eggs, ah, bean sprout. Also, this is the garlic chives. Ah. Oh, perfect. So this part is the optional of pad Thai. We got shallot onions, tofu, and. Pickle radish. Ooh, yummy. Mm. Nice. Everything okay? 
All ingredients, you like it? Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> ah. And here for pasta eel, you also got rice noodles same, but it's the fresh one, wild thick one. Mm -hmm. Also eggs, ah. carrot, baby corn. Chinese kale. Ah. Very cool. Yeah, kale you can use the broccoli as a substitute. Oh, Those okay. cases are similar. similar. Yeah. What do we have other? It's the seasoning. Ooh. The first one is the cooking oil, brown sugar, Oops. the fish sauce, fish sauce. oyster sauce. Oyster sauce, okay. okay. Add one scoop of oil. Yay. Good job, Ruby. Then we're gonna spread oil around the wok. Ah, and yes, like this. Garlic and soy protein. Yes. It smells so good. Yeah. That garlic. Yes. Okay. Ah. Good job, Ruby. How's Timmy doing over there? Nice. It smells bloody delicious. This smells so good, doesn't it? It smells good. Ruby's cracking an egg. <laughs> yeah, Ruby! You did it! Ah, you can just wipe. On your friend. There we go. Ah, good job, Ruby. Okay. 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 Oh. One for Ruby. Okay, Ruby's almost done. You're doing such a good job, Ruby. Thank you. You're welcome. Delicious. I know. It is going to be delicious. Yes. So we all have to make different kinds. Yes, we are making okay. different kinds. Mine is done over here. Thank you. And Timmy's is done. Look at yours. Beautiful. Beautiful. Alright you guys, so we just finished up cooking everything and Ruby did such a good job. Yes. But look at mine. Yes, Ruby made pad thai. Yeah, pad thai. Yes. <laughs> Which we heard here and I made it and Mama and me, Mama and Bubba made something that yes. we you haven't go? heard yet. You wanna try it? I'm gonna try it. Looks good. Looks delicious. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you know Nice. Good job! <laughs> you made that! How did it go? Good job. But I so made pad sui. It looks delicious. It oh my god, you put so many things in here. It came together so fast yeah, too. Mmm. So good. good. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I made holy basil stir fry. Yeah. And I think I made it extremely spicy. Mmm. Yeah. I put, put a lot of peppers he, in there. Yeah, he put so much peppers. I think he put like four or six or five peppers in there <laughs> is so much. But he wanted to be extra spicy. Mm -hmm. And I didn't put any peppers in mine because I don't want it to be spicy. Yeah? That's really good, yeah. Yum. It tastes so good together. I did this myself. Yeah, you did. That's your first cooking <laughs> I made cereal. Yeah, <laughs> right. Chopping. <laughs> no. <laughs> so the first ingredients for everyone. Now we have to add lemongrass, kalango, yes, protein soy. Yes. The chili jam. Jack, you're 
Okay. Sticky rice powder. Sticky rice? Powder. Yes, add two powder. scoops two scoop. for the thickness. Very cool. Okay, and now everyone is gonna add mushrooms and onions. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, then we need tamarind sauce, two scoops. Two scoops. Okay, and now everyone, make sure they heat down to the lowest heat and then add all vegetables. Tomato, green onion, cilantro. Smell the cilantro. Yummy. Ah, here, Mr. Tim, you have extra sweet basil, pluck off the leaves. Pluck off the leaves. Ah, everyone need. Please try the soup. Taste the soup. Ooh, it's really good. Anything else? Tastes good, yeah. Anything else? No. Yeah. If you like it, please turn off the gas. And the bowl will go to behind you. We're going to make appetizer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, for Mr. Tim, fish yes. cake, I would like you cut green bean, very thin. Very thin, yes. okay. Deep fried corn. Cool. Not easy. Nope. Burn some skin. <laughs> I'm telling you, frying is hard. <laughs> yes, yeah, not easy. I am the worst at frying. Can you tell which one's hers? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, those are hers and those are yours. Oh, one of hers. Oh, that's so funny. It's finished her spring rolls over here. We have to just fry it. Yes. The oil is not ready yet, so we yeah. have to wait. Yes. Drop it in the fish cakes and see how it is with this one. Oh, no, it's good. <laughs> yeah, that's <was> serious. <laughs> good job. There you go. There it goes. There it goes. Ooh. Yeah, he's touching them to flatten them out. Is it going to be juicy? Everything. <laughs> 
up in the moon. Good job, Ruby! Okay, okay. We made so much. <laughs> so we've got the soups over here. I got the tam yum, tam yum soup. It's spicy soup. And then we've got the salad right here. It's a glass noodle salad. Tastes so good. And then Ruby made some spring rolls. And then she's got the coconut milk soup with soy protein instead of chicken. And then Timmy fried up some sweet corn. Deep fried some corn. Deep fried some corn, yes. Also deep fried some fish cakes. Yes, he did. Look how good he did. They're a little spicy. And then he's got his soup over there. What did you make? I believe it's holy basil soup. Oh, yummy. Yeah. I'm basically a chef, so. How's it taste, Ruby? Oh, it's just amazing. It's just amazing? Mmm. Good? Oh my god, so good. You put that chili jam in there too. Mm-hmm. That was good. That broth is everything. Really? Everything is so good. <laughs> Yum. Mmm. Mm. Is it good? It's delicious. Get fish cake. Get fish cake up, bro. Mmm. Yeah. Oh wow, Tim. That's what I do. Those are amazing. They're so like, perfectly salty. Mmm. We're just gonna try some deep fried corn. We gotta make it at home. Get that bubble me. Yeah. <laughs> Good job, Tim. High five. So I should be expecting you to cook breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And for the now. camera's off. <laughs>
last dish. This is curry. We all made different types of curry. I made a red one. Ruby made panning curry. I made green curry. Yes. Ooh. So cool. Knowing where they all come from. I mean like Fresh. all the ingredients. Yes. It's definitely hard work to make this 100% from scratch. Yes. But it turned out amazing. And they taste so good. So good. We just got a banana. Sticky rice. It looks so good. Yes. <laughs> I'm gonna try it with the mango <laughs> and then the rocks. Ooh. Fresh. Yummy? Mm, perfect. Perfect. You did a great job of cooking today. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. Alright you guys, so, so we made it back after that amazing cooking class. It was so cool. We yeah. ate so many, so many different dishes. Mm -hmm. I've never in my life eaten that much in one day. <laughs> it was so much food. But it was all so yes, good. It was so good and such a great experience. Like we learned Absolutely. exactly what goes in Thai food and I had no clue beforehand. Like we barely yeah. ever had Thai food. I think maybe we've had like Thai stir fry, but like yeah, that's yeah. basically been it. For like, sure. Nothing else. So so it was so nice to learn and our guide was amazing. Oh my god, she, she was, was awesome. So sweet. Her family so was awesome. helpful. Yeah, the whole family, they're so sweet. Yeah. And she helped so much with Ruby. Yes, yeah, she did. She did so much for she us. Basically like, cooked Ruby. So. Yeah, one hundred percent highly, highly recommend you do it. And if you do decide to do it, make sure you go to the same place we went to, Cook Venture. Yes, you have yes. to go there. We'll leave all that information in the description box. Yeah, she was amazing. I feel like if it wasn't for her it wouldn't have been as cool yeah because of how she treated us and yes. how she was explaining everything yeah. and all that so, so I, patient too. yeah definitely patient mm -hmm. but uh yeah i think she definitely made the experience yeah and it was really cool she picked us up from our airbnb and then she took us to the market we got to see all the things that we were gonna mm -hmm. be using and learned how they grow it, where they go to get it and all of that. And then she took us to the cooking class um, spot. And yeah, it was just incredible. And, it was awesome. And she took us back here, which was really nice. Yeah. yeah. Good thing her suspension was working because on the way back home, there was a lot of weight in the back seat. <laughs> we will definitely be going on a little bit of a cleanse or a big cleanse actually after this because we have just been eating really bad lately. I feel like yep. we've been making up for Ramadan. Oh, for like, sure. Times ten yeah. this, this month, so yeah, we pass that up. We're, we're going to be like clean eating from here on out for a while because we need balance in our lives. <laughs> and when we were done, she gave us these little cookbooks. Oh, yeah, yes, you, you get a cookbook yeah. too when you eat. Yeah, yeah. Uh, what on the end when you eat? So it gives you like three cookbooks, and so you don't forget, so you can make them at home too. Yes, exactly. are you gonna start cooking for us? When yeah. I get older. Oh, yeah. but I think you know how now. Yeah, you just did it. Yeah. I, I can't read though. Oh, okay. We'll wait until you can read and then you can start cooking for us? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you want to subscribe, please do. <laughs> please yeah. do. But hit that like button too. Yeah. Yes. And we'll see you guys next time. <laughs> bye bye. Bye bye.